Hello everybody, welcome back to the channel, my name is Ron, and today we have a little bit of a different discussion video. This isn't going to be Deep Rock related, although I will be talking about Deep Rock briefly in this, as well as a couple other games. I recently put up a poll on the channel that has already gotten 5,000 votes over like a day. I'm surprised that this one got as many as it did. So this is a very simple question asking, which do you find easier to use? A mouse and keyboard? Sorry, keyboard's underneath the mic or a controller. So about 70% of people said mouse and keyboard, 30% of people said controller. I'm a little bit surprised by that, uh, just because I would think initially controller would be kind of a go-to for just convenience, for comfy sake. That being said, this is coming from somebody who primarily played on consoles for the longest time and didn't really have a gaming PC. For the longest time, I was playing on like laptops cheap computers that I could buy or cheap computers that I kind of built myself until I could actually build something that was pretty decent for actually playing games and recording and editing and stuff like that. When I was usually playing on mouse and keyboard and playing on computer in general, it was mostly kind of older games that the old computers that I had could actually handle. So I was playing things like Diablo 2, uh, Warcraft 3, Plants vs. Zombies, other RTS games, some turn-based games, stuff like that. So nothing that was super demanding on my computer. However, when I was playing on console a lot, I was playing a lot of first-person shooter games. I was playing things like Bioshock, Call of Duty, uh, games like that. So whenever I started playing on a gaming computer and I had a first-person shooter game, I would usually play it with controller because I was far more familiar with that. That was kind of my comfort zone. I would go to that, even though I would consistently hear people saying that mouse and keyboard is superior, which, yeah, it kind of is, uh, definitely in any sort of competitive game. The mouse is far easier to aim with once you get used to it than something like the sticks on a controller, It's unless you have like insane aim assist on certain games like Red Dead or something like that. Those games definitely benefit a whole lot more from having a mouse that you can control. Keyboard can also be that way. I found this out first off when I was trying to play through the Stalker series. When I was doing that, I still was not used to mouse and keyboard, so I took a controller and I took a program that let me program whatever keys I wanted to to my controller because it didn't have controller support, so I could actually play with it. I ran into a problem really fast though, and that was that I found out the controller that I had did not have nearly enough buttons for all the things that you could do in Stalker, which made it really difficult for me. So pretty much I had all of my combat controls and everything on my actual controller, uh, as well as movement, all that. So I could loot, I could shoot, I could run around. Problem was, is as soon as it came to inventory management or anything like that, it became really difficult for me. Um, same with all the extra things that you could do, like putting on thermal optics, switching out your sights, going through bags, using different items quickly. I didn't have any quick use slots or anything like that. So every time I got shot and was bleeding and I was using my controller, I'd have to set this down, get into my inventory, move my mouse around, kind of do this as like a uh, inventory management game really quick because it was far faster than trying to use the uh, controller to move around and do that. So I could stop myself from like bleeding or whatever was horribly happening to me. Uh, and then switch back to this. And it just became very difficult for me to do that. So now I tend to use uh, keyboard and mouse. In Deep Rock Galactic I use this, in other games like Hunt Showdown, Payday, pretty much any sort of shooters that I play now, I usually use mouse and keyboard. But that's not the case for every game. Killing Floor 2 I still regularly play with a controller, like all the time, just because I have like 1200 hours in the game and it feels really weird to switch to mouse and keyboard now. Uh, same goes with Dead by Daylight. I, even though certain killers, certain things that you can do with mouse and keyboard do seem better, I don't see it as a huge advantage as compared to controller a lot of the time. I don't feel like I'm getting completely outplayed if I just am using a controller over mouse and keyboard. And that could be different depending on, again, what like killers you're playing. If you're playing Nurse, Oni, uh, Blight, anybody who can like flick around really fast. Yeah, mouse and keyboard is going to be a lot easier to do that with. Uh, but when I'm playing somebody like Hillbilly, I actually find controller to be a lot easier to use. It feels a lot more natural with the movement. Same goes with like Leatherface or if I'm just playing a killer where I'm just running around normally. So Wraith or Trapper or whatever. So I just kind of wanted to make this video. I thought it would be kind of a fun, interesting thing to talk about. Originally, I wasn't even planning on making this into a video. I was just genuinely curious to see what people would say. I figured controller would win by a decent amount just because it it feels a little bit easier, at least for me, to just pick up and play most games. Or if I'm playing something like Red Dead, or even if I'm playing a more casual, maybe first-person shooter game like Fallout, you know, controller works just fine. Same goes with if I'm doing a platforming game or a fighting game or 
something. Mouse and keyboard though is definitely the way to go for any sort of like shooter game or first person exploration game. I tend to go with this. Thanks everybody for taking the time to vote for this. I plan on doing other polls, not just Deep Rock related, but other game related and other topics like this. They are super fun to discuss with you guys and it's really interesting to see how the polls come out as well as to hear your guys' comments. A lot of people said it depends on which type of game I'm playing or I only have a console so I'm kind of stuck with a controller. Thanks again. I hope you guys enjoyed this. Special thanks to the supporters of this channel. If you'd like to be a supporter of the channel, you can. There are links down in the description as well as the join button down below on YouTube. Really do appreciate that. It does help out the channel a lot. Hope you guys have a great rest of your day and I'll talk to you next time. Bye-bye.